guys, so I'm going to be showing you how to easily put um, a foam like this into uh, your Poang IKEA chair cover because I've heard some horrible stories about um, how difficult it is to put uh, the foam in and the main reason is because of the texture that they have inside the foam I don't know what it is but it just sticks onto the foam like like there's no tomorrow and you can't fix it once you put it in so what you have to do is you have to uh, cut out either um, a cardboard piece of paper or a uh, poster paper works really well um, around the same size as the as this sheet here this way so I already cut out uh, cardboard uh, that's about the same size I've already done the top part which was the more difficult part because it was bigger um, but it's pretty easy once you stick the cardboard in so I'm just gonna show you this sticking it in okay I'm gonna have to stand up a little bit here Okay, I think I stuck it in pretty well. One of the things you want to make sure you do is to, you want to make sure you slip it into this side with this material and not this side. So you want to make sure the cardboard is um, st uh, touching the, the sticky side of it. Um, and you want to make sure the ends of the cardboard is touching the corners. The main thing is the corners because you want to fit it as far as possible without the foam getting stuck when you put it in. So now I'm going to be putting in the card, um, the foam into the cardboard. Let's see which way it's supposed to be first. Um, so what I like to do is I like to fold it a little bit this way and stick it in because they designed it where the zippers are not the full length, so you can you can't stick it in uh, flat. You have to fold it in just a little bit on the side before you stick it in. So here you can see that I've put in the foam and the cardboard is still in between this layer. And what you want to do is you want to make sure you stick your hands in to the farthest, grab the corner of the foam and try to push it as far as you can all the way into the corner uh, with a good fit. And then um, you can slowly start to unfold this part that I folded. So there we go. I'm just going to pull out pull out the cardboard now so that I can un uh, zip it back up. But you might see some curvatures. Uh, I recommend you to put the whole thing underneath your, your couch or your bed just to flatten it for 